Good morning! We are going to hike a whole 2.8 miles. Then we're gonna hitch into Julian. Then we're gonna have an apple pie. <laughs> and then we're gonna try to upload things because I'm behind in uploading videos. And then we're gonna like walk around. And, and find then, a new tent. And then we're gonna find her a new tent and new shoes. And then and then we're gonna probably have lunch. And then we're gonna check in. And then we're gonna do laundry. And then I'm gonna sleep. Yeah. All night. And then Chap is gonna tell me to socialize. And probably I will. And we have to shower. Yeah, we do have to shower. And well, I forgot about us. that. And laundry. laundry. I laundry. forgot the most important things. We need to shower. Shower. laundry. 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 Okay. Shower. Okay, let's go. Okay, bye. Yeah. That's okay. <laughs> So yesterday night was pretty windy. It was cool, but not as cold as the night before. And then Chap said something about it being 31 degrees this morning. So cold enough, but not the 21 that we had the night before. The sun is coming out today. And uh, anything else? I think that was it when it comes to sleeping. Something going on. Look who we found, Mr. Buddy. How you doing? All right, they already found a ride. You can fit four, five. So, Chap and I will try to do the hitchhiking thing. Should be fun. I'm excited. So we just saw Doug and buddy the two people well actually doug we rescued dogs are people too and buddy was just hanging out with us he would just wanted to say thank you and now we're gonna try to get a hitch bye say hi I never get to go and get a money order when I need it. Oh, there's the light, but I ain't open. Alrighty, well, we're somewhere. I don't think this is it. But this is Julian. Got a super fast hitch. Put my thumb out, waved at somebody, picked us up. Was super cool. Because she's played in a lot of movies like that. Can you do the Moira accent? David. 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 Sorry. Um, <laughs> we dropped off our backpack. Backpacks. And now we're going to walk back to get some breakfast or mom's pie or both and all of the above. <laughs> I didn't know you were actually jumping. Chap is a sh <laughs> knight in shining armor right there. Okay. Remember? They're closed. Yeah, they're closed. Yeah,
didn't even see that. <laughs> That's the first thing I saw. Like, wait, that, that looks I'm fine. I'm going to get that big-ass burrito thing. Salud! Salud! Cheers! Prost, prost, cheers! All the above. Look at her now. Plus one, what'd you get? She's a tea power ball. Dispatch, what'd you get? A burrito! Oh, that does look Onward, good. what'd you got? Julian Cafe Omelet. Ooh, side of bacon. Ooh, side of bacon, what'd you got? PCT power ball. And I got biscuits and gravy! Yeah. yeah. And we even got a discount. Boom, 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 boom. Guess we're going to the outfitter, which is upstairs. <laughs> Old chap has a new job. He's now the shoe connoisseur. I okay. think they're too wide. You don't have that big of a foot. But it wide. does that they are. <laughs> Her. Just finished buying some stuff at the Outfitter, going to the grocery store, going to see how a tent will work out. I did the same thing. Huh? <laughs> yeah. 10 out of 10 bench. So I didn't really explain much, but um, Whitney, our awesome trail mate, we called her teabag first, then dispatch. We think maybe she's changed it to Fireball. One of my subscribers actually suggested Fireball and we're like, that's actually perfect. It totally fits her. She, she liked dispatch, but she didn't really feel like it fit her very well but she has some tent issues, so she's trying to fix that, some shoe issues, so she's trying to fix that. So, um, plus one, Chap and I, we're gonna get that free apple pie. a certain kind of way, that's how we do it, and we have to dry it. Moving on to find some food. Probably a brewery, because Mr. Chap right here likes the breweries. No brewery left unturned seems to be a continuous theme, whether we're on the AT or the PCT. Chap is eating pizza with a fork. He's trying to be a European. With a messy trying, pizza. He's trying to go with that method. European pizza eating method. So, um, <laughs> what happened to the spam you just bought? There are other Show me. First. Yeah, I'm joining in now. We're doing half the European way, half the American way. <laughs> it's disgusting. It is molded. <laughs> There's mold in the spam she just bought. <laughs> so, we are picking up. Fireballs, non moldy spam. And then. Had a day. She has had a day. We'll talk about it in a second. It's never a boring time with Fireball. So, ex trying to explain this in a very uh, make sense kind of way. So, yesterday we looked at her beautiful tent and we saw some seam ceiling that was not well done at all and of course we thought it was her because some people i mean it literally looked like a kindergartner was seam sealing it then we find out from her that this was actually seam sealed by the company and so today we went to the outfitter and the outfitter is a dealer when it comes to that brand and then we called the i guess the owner or the manager of that company and he was a little bit resistant it was like what do you want me to do? Yeah, he kind of like, kind of customer service-y, but not really. Um, she's brand new to this, so he kind of was trying to take advantage of her, and little chap was trying to help by giving her advice on what to say. And the guy was like, I only want to deal with the person who purchased it, which, yeah, 
I can see that. It's pretty reasonable. But I'm just but a it, baby. <laughs> but at the same time, it's nice to have somebody who can help you give some feedback, right? Yeah. Look, look who it is. Onward. Onward. He knows the story. Um, and so then eventually he's like, can you please send us a video? We send a video. Well, first I had to truck myself and my tent to the fire station. Oh, I hold had on. Call. No, we, we first call. Like, yeah. we first we send him a video. And then he was like, I don't know what you want us to do. And we're just kind of like, okay, well, I guess that's a reasonable question. But also, like, the seam ceiling is bad and she's got holes in the tent, which actually I didn't mention. There's holes in the on the sides so then he's like send us a video we send the video and then he's like okay find a place to spray water on it <laughs> where am i gonna find that well she went to i called the fire station i'm like i have a really odd question but can i bring my tent over there set it up and use your hose to spray my tent to see if there's a hole in it and his literally his question was like well, after you do that, are you going to stay in it on the property? And I was like, no, I promise. I have a, I have a hotel. I won't, I won't stay there. I just need to spray wow. it. And he was like, yeah, come on down. The two of the nicest guys, they literally sprayed the tent while I was inside trying to see if the water was coming in the holes, which they were. And I was able to take the video and send it to them. So she finally made a video for the owner that there's really holes in there which is just crazy you have to go through that but anyway she did and then i guess they replaced her tent um which is great mm -hmm. great customer service yes. there but she now has to seam seal her own tent and so which is of course you know makes sense since they mm -hmm. seem sealed and it looks like ridiculous let's try it ourselves yeah. which i'm sure we're gonna do so such a better job probably not probably not but, but so now we're thinking, well, how are we going to seam seal this? Because it has to be over 60 degrees for the four hours. And she figured something out. And that is she's going to set it up in the lobby of the hotel. We asked. And they said yes. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? So, crazy. so then it can dry overnight in above 60 degree weather. So we just spent, it wasn't even that long, 10 minutes looking, looking for, for rocks. Yeah, rocks. People were looking at us in the parking lot. What are they doing? We looked we, ridiculous. We piled our, our stones of rocks together like, this is our rock. Yeah. So yeah, maybe I'll film us setting up that tent and seam sealing it, but that's the story. Yeah. Never, never bore you when you're around never, her. Never, never. Because she also had some shoe problems. Yeah. And... I can't feel my toes, but that's normal. She said that's that normal. normal. Very normal. <laughs> okay. That was it. So here, all of us are just uh, experiencing this wonderful moment of setting up the tent. I'm doing so much. What's happening? We are setting up the tent. Well, she is. In the tea room. In the tea room. I think it's gentle piano. So there's a cat in this room. So probably we're not going to be able to do it here. So we'll have to do it on trail.